Good morning, Granite Bay. Today we'll be discussing the club information, spring schedule changes, and more. Also, we'll discuss winter ball information and an exciting new podcast coming to GBTV. All that and more right here on GBTV. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Grizzlies. Today is Friday, November 21st. I'm Catalina Diaz. And I'm Jake Russell, and we have a fantastic bulletin for you today, so let's slide on in. To start us off, the Peer Connection Center has some announcements for you, so let's take a look. Hi, everyone. I'm Mada Gufran. And I'm Cameron Buck. Welcome back to the Peer Connections Corner. Today, we have a wellness workshop, meditation. Never tried it before? Come on down and give it a try. Join us in room 812 during both lunches to meditate your stress away. Today after school, we also have a Peer Perspectives Club meeting in room 812 about friendships, the healthy and the toxic. Hope to see you there. For those of you who don't know, Peer Connections is a student-run program on campus designed to help and support students in a variety of ways. One of our specialties is listening and chatting with students who just need to talk. These one-on-ones are confidential and your peers are trained to provide you with the best support possible. So if you need to vent, are worried about a friend, or just want to connect with someone who understands what you're going through, drop us a line. Text us at 916-597-0509 or walk on into room A12 when it's convenient for you. Freshmen, look out for an invitation to our Freshman Connection events throughout this week. Join peer counselors and your fellow freshmen during your designated lunchtime for a themed activity. Thank you so much and have a wonderful week. Thank you, Beer Counseling. We appreciate all you do for our school's community. Last week, Granite Bay Media aired our first episode of Barely News. Make sure to check it out on Granite Bay today or at the link below. Reminder, seniors, the deadline for that personal finance exam is on January 31st. Congratulations to golfer Ellie Bushnell for firing your way into the CIF NorCal Golf Championships. She has been honored by Sports Star Magazine as Sports Star of the Week. Way to go and represent our Grizzly golfers. If you're stressed about a test or exam, Peer Counseling is opening up workshops just for that going on now till December 18th on Wednesdays in the Wellness Center. Tomorrow, Grand Canyon University is coming at 11.15 and California North State University College of Health Sciences will be here when we return from break. To conclude our TV segment today, we would like to introduce you to a local craft, Peachy Pearls. Take it away. Hi, Grizzlies. My name is Ashley Chen and I am a sophomore at Grundy Bay High. Hi Grizzlies, I'm Maya McCarty. I'm a senior at Granite Bay High School. We're selling Visco bracelets. Visco bracelets are handmade bracelets made out of embroidery floss or craft thread. We take all of our orders on our Instagram page. Our Instagram page is called Peachy Pearls. We chose to call our business Peachy Pearls because Peachy stands for like fine or cool and pearls are supposed to stand for beads or like bracelets so yeah it's a pretty cool name. Uh, what inspired us was um, I was selling stuff with my mom and we were able to sell enough um, bracelets and other stuff and we were able to um, fundraise money to buy my uh, cousin who has autism a tablet so he could communicate with us. Um, seeing my cousin smile um, inspired us to make other kids smile with the same condition. So our main purpose is to fundraise money with kids who have autism. However, if you want to help and you are not planning on buying a bracelet, you can help spread the word around. Make sure to go get your custom bracelets and support small businesses. Small businesses do make the world go round. Do you need college application support? Maybe you're confused or lost on how to apply well to your dream school. If this applies to you, then head on over to the library on November 21st after school from 2.35 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. In other news, make sure to follow the Win a Ball Instagram account 
at Grand Bay Winter Ball 2019 to see all the invented questions and submit yours for a chance to win free Winter Ball tickets. Deadline to submit your entry is December 9th. And Mr. Brawley is starting up his 24th annual GBHS Beard Growing Contest. Let your, facial let your facial follicles flourish all throughout the holidays and beyond for the title of the best beard. Everyone on campus is invited to participate, so flaunt your facial hair freely. Good luck! Do you have an ugly sweater? If so, this year is your year. GBTV is hosting an ugly Christmas sweater contest and we couldn't be more excited. Hey Grizzlies, it's that time of the year again when we don our ugly Christmas sweaters and participate in one of the universe's most beloved Christmas traditions, the ugly Christmas sweater contest. We're doing one here at Granite Bay High School. And if you want to participate for a chance to win a fun, fun prize, then come to media or room 506 during both lunches or grist time on December 6th in your ugly Christmas sweater to get filmed. Once you will be filmed, you'll be aired and voting will proceed. If you win the votes, then you can win a prize. So come to media room 506 on December 6th to get filmed in your ugly Christmas sweater. Good luck and have a great day. You better wear some really ugly sweaters, Grizzlies. Otherwise, Henry the boy is gonna steal that gift card and the show. That dog doesn't stand a chance against my sweater. It is coming up on Thanksgiving, that special time to think about what you're thankful for. The media team took the streets to go out and discover what our Grizzlies are truly thankful for. Take it away, boys. What's up, Granite Bay? I'm Jacob Lesko. Let's talk Thanksgiving. Uh, what are you thankful for? Uh, Kobe Weeks Sr. Uh, I'm thankful for my little sister Kaya. I'm thankful for my family and friends because they're always supporting me. I'm thankful for my family and my name is Andrew Costigan. Alright, so we're here to ask what, what are you thankful for? I'm thankful for my friends and my family. Damn right. What are you thankful for, Kate Nicholas Hines? What? <laughs> thankful for? What are you thankful for? What is that? Oh, thankful for. Um, <laughs> I'm thankful for my friends and my family and uh, all my possessions, everything I have. Like? Such as my dog, uh, my sister. That's enough. I'm really thankful for all my friends and teachers who have supported me through my high school career and bring me to the person I am today. And uh, you, Vinny? Yeah, uh, my friends and um, Coach Cooley. Jake, what are you thankful for? Well, excellent question, Catalina. I'm personally thankful for a marching band for giving me a place to play music with some of my best friends. What about you? I mean, I was gonna say my tractor, but go off, I guess. Speaking of our marching band, the GBHS Emerald Brigade is leaving this Friday, today, for the Western Band Association's 2019 Grand Championships. As the two-year defending 4A champions, the Emerald Brigade will be heading off to perform with some of the best bands in the West Coast for a chance to defend our title with their award-winning show, Area 51. If you see someone you know who is in band, make sure to wish them luck in this daunting exhibition, and let's hope they come back with another win for our school. Good luck. Grizzlies, the opportunity to make changes to your spring schedule is waning away. Students who would like to request a schedule change for their spring schedule may do so online at the GVHS website at granitebayhigh.org on December 11th and 12th. There will not be an opportunity to change classes in January. Both the online form and a list of open classes will be posted and available after school on Wednesday, December 11th. The form should be completed online by 11.59 p.m. on Thursday, December 12th. Although many classes are full, counselors will do their best to accommodate schedule change requests. However, making the request is no guarantee a change can be accommodated. Changes that can be accommodated will be reflected in home link after Tuesday, December 17th. Students may check in class Students may check by clicking classes under the student information tab in home link. In summary, complete the following steps. First, on December 9th and 11th, review your spring schedule online in Aries. Second, in December 11th and 12th, check the school webpage for the list of open classes and the online form after school beginning on the 12th. And third, on December 17th, winter break, review your spring schedule in areas to determine if your schedule change was, popu 
was possible. An unchanged schedule means the request could not be accommodated. Reminder, there are no guarantees. And now, Grizzlies, I think you know what time it is. It is time for our weekly Grizzly Pride card drawing. Each week, as you know, we draw two cards. This week's winners are Alexis Rakoba, recommended by Mr. Phillips, and Ben Letter, recommended by Miss Sampson. Congratulations, Grizzlies. Head on over to the front office to claim your prize. If you've received a Pride card from a teacher, you can use your cards to purchase items in the student store, and your cards are automatically entered into the drawing box located in the front office. If you have an announcement recognition or story ID you want shown in the GBTV broadcast, submit it to the GBHS communication request Google form at the link below. Also, be sure to follow Granite Bay High Twitter and, and Instagram account and our Instagram account at Granite Bay TV. Well, Grizzlies, that's it for today. Have a great break, and until next time... Have a great day, Granite Bay, and... Go, go Grizzlies! Grizzlies.